to be a fun one. We knew that 61 was going to be fun. So Joe Cologne taking on uh, Nashon Garrett. Cologne in the blue singlet. Nashon in the red. Cologne, Titan Mercury, currently training the Valley RTC. Nashon obviously out of Arizona State. It's got Nashon has Victoria Anthony and Angel Cejudo in his corner. And looks like Anthony Abedin and Steven Abbas in Cologne's corner. Valley RTC had an excellent day yesterday. We're going to see a couple of them in the finals. Blaze Cabell a little later. Ref's pointing at Cologne. Looks like we might get our first passive to go against him. And that is correct. That is correct. Uh, both of these guys had crazy, crazy matches. Uh, Cologne's quarterfinal with Dardanes was 14-12. Nashon uh, was, I think, 15-8 with Cody Brewer. And yeah, 61 was crazy. You got to go back and watch it. And look at the quickness from Nashon trying to trip. And almost a little too quick. Lost control of that leg. Cologne kicking out of it. So both wrestlers now have a passive call against them. Sixty one was insane at the Bill Farrell last year, which was the non Olympic weight trials. It was insane at the US Open. Insane here, folks. Sixty one is gonna be fun going forward as Cologne in on the shot here. Nashon feeding him hips and body lock here. Up in the air. Cologne gonna finish this. Look at that gut wrench, folks. He's still got that strength. By all accounts, one of the strongest 57, 61 guys there is, Joe Cologne. And don't think he's going to be able to get that second one. I was very happy about that. Good 4-0 lead for Cologne here. One twelve left to go in the first period. And Cologne getting attention here for some hands-to-the-face stuff. Nishan looking to pick his spots. And right in on that double. He's going to get him up in the air. Cologne. My goodness, how did he not get taken down there? Didn't expose. Hard whizzer. And I thought they just got some points there. Over on the edge. Somebody's going to get a point here. Now, I saw Cologne's hand hit first. And the ref agrees with me, as does the judge. That one was right in front of me, so I should get that one right. Thirty seconds to go here. This is the best Joe Clunes looked in quite some time. And you know, this is gonna be very important as far as well, team trials going this year. Winning a bracket like this gives you an advantage. Driving through is Cologne on the edge, six to one now. And whenever he really commits to his shot so far in this match, he's been able to just drive through. Nishan sneaking a peek at the clock, and that's how we're going to end first period here, six to one. Some funky stuff going on in the uh, Tony Ramos, Cody Brewer third place match, unsurprisingly. Ramos trying to avenge his loss from who's number one, 2014 champ versus 2015 NCAA champ 133 there. But we're back to action here in our first place match. Nashon really trying to move Cologne around now. You see him snapping. And on the shot once again, great wizard position. From Cologne, gonna stay grounded, no points. Cologne so incredibly fast with that whizzer. Uh, you saw it about halfway through the first period when Nation got him up in the air. 
Nishan's smiling at him here. I think it's because he jammed up his thumb a little bit. Oh my goodness. That was a clean ankle pick, folks. Six to three now. Still in favor of Cologne. Nishan not doing a whole lot on top. That was slickety slick slick. <laughs> it's funny, the, kind of both these guys, after the other one scores, kind of slowing down, changing a little bit, keeping their keeping their defense on edge. Nation feet really far apart, and Cologne just moved him halfway across the mat. Nation can shoot him out here. Once again, back into that wizard. Jake Cologne wizards faster than just about anybody. 152 left. You know, the single. Coming up with it, trying to come out the back door. Nation draped hard. Cologne unable to throw that seatbelt in, bring it across his hip. Reaching back there, got to be careful. And somebody's going to get exposed here. I mean, almost definitely. He's trapped the leg with the foot. I like that. Getting creative. Cologne staying very patient. Hook that heel. Turned in and 10 to 3 after that gut wrench. 12 to three, and this was the, you know, kind of the difference in the Ramos match. Was able to tip him over a few times. One more, finish it off. Man, if I was Cologne, I would have pushed that tech. I know you're dominating Nashon, but he's not a guy I want to give time on the clock. Nashon doesn't have much choice here but to go into sprint mode. Cologne catches it, double unders on the edge, and that should do it, folks. So Joe Cologne comes through the meat grinder that was this 61 kilo bracket. Steven Avis is psyched. Joe Cologne, 20th Dave Schultz, Memorial Champion.